for us, there have never been any limits, only the limits we imposed on ourselves. At the beginning of this millennium, our planet prospered, and we prospered with it. But our incessant greed led to the impoverishment of nature and turned a flourishing garden into a lifeless and dangerous desert. We became strangers to each other. We renounced our values and our ideals. We squeezed the last resources from the earth, but we still weren't satisfied. Soot and steel was all that was left of a once green oasis. And our planet became a stranger to us. But we had learned a lesson. My oxygen filter is acting up. All morning it's been as dry as a desert in the cockpit. We'll need to pay a visit to the repair yard when we get back. All morning? You've got some sense of humor there, Derek. It's always night here, and always a desert. <laughs> Seekers, enthusiasts, and dreamers, we directed all our efforts outward and became not destroyers, but creators. Our robots and drilling equipment bit into the featureless white ground, sinking meter by meter into the very heart of our only moon, so that one day we would be able to get through this mass of dead moon soil and extract real treasure. Our new house that will help us renew our old one. By exceeding our limits, we freed ourselves from our chains.